When did you start chewing tobacco? Um, when I was a young player and I wasn't playing. You know, you kind of get bored and you start to mess around. I couldn't do it when I played. And, you know, obviously I get so nervous during games, and I still do, that I kind of chew the inside of my cheek because I just get nervous. Now I wrap it in gum because, one, it's it's a terrible habit. And I, and I know it. And I don't want kids seeing it, thinking it's cool. So I always try to wrap it in gum just because I just don't. It's, I, it, I don't know. I just don't think it's a great message to send. But I don't try to lie about it either. I mean, it's it's there, and I do it. And the day the season's over, I quit. And then the day the season starts, I start again. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know who came up with this. So I tried it, and I got so buzzed. And then one time I swallowed some, and I went, I'll never be a big leaguer because I can't chew tobacco. Well, well, you know, it's funny, Dan. I, this is, you know, I chew the, the tobacco, the leaf tobacco, the the Copenhagen stuff, the stuff. Yeah. I tried that my first week at college. I was at a rush party, and I ended up sleeping underneath the wheel of a fire engine because it didn't agree with me at all. I, mean, it just, I, I can't even smell it to this day. Oh. But but now with the leaf stuff, if I swallow it, I've been doing this so long, because all it does is give me the hiccups. So it's, it's, it's amazing how different it is. For more Dan Patrick Show, tune to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV or download the Dan Patrick Show app.